Yeah, that's right, Brian. For more than 15 years, customers tell me they have shopped at Bilo Grocery Store, and after finding out it's closing, they tell me they're sad to see it go. I really kind of hate that the store is leaving a little bit. Sharon King shops at this Bilo store and says it's close to her home and items are often on sale. It's the only Bilo left in Charlotte, and it will be closing its doors in two weeks. I just think in the radius. It's a lot of supermarkets, so it's not surprising. June Carruthers shops at the store at least once a week for her mom. And they have everything that she likes here, like the dairy, her uh, coffee products, her vegetables. She's not thrilled about having to find another place to buy groceries for her. I am really sad this store is closing. I like the store a lot. It's really convenient, really easy to get in, get out. Inside, empty shelves show the reality of what's to come. Items have been marked down and all sales are final. The company tells Fox 46 is closing all of its Bilo stores and was bought out by the company Food Lion. About 8% of families in the 28214 zip code are living below poverty and having this Bilo help people without cars get their food a little easier. Zach Duncan says there are other options like Walmart and Harris Teeter nearby, but it requires neighbors to drive a little further. I guess I just had to go early, early. <laughs> in the morning to beat the crowds, you know. So it just gives us less options, really. So if they're going to put something else here, I just hope it's something that we can really use uh, on this side of town. Now, the store is set to close April 11th, and Food Lion says it will be bringing in a new store, but no opening date has been set. Reporting live in North Charlotte, I'm Jamal Goss, Fox 46.